Hey guys, I'm John Setzler. Welcome back to Atlanta Grill Company for another short. Today I'm going to give you yet another side dish that's great for any kind of meal. We're going to make some mashed potatoes, so let's get started. We're going to start out this mashed potatoes recipe with about three pounds of Yukon Gold potatoes. So the next thing I've done, I've diced those potatoes in about a one inch dice. I've peeled them and diced them and I've got them in my Dutch oven here covered with water and I'm going to put a good bit of salt in that water and we're going to bring these to a simmer. And while our potatoes are coming to a simmer, I'm going to melt some butter in another small saucepan. And once that butter starts melting, I've got four cloves of smashed garlic that I'm going to toss in there, just with the papers and everything. And we're going to let that steep as the butter melts. And as that butter finishes melting, I've got some fresh sage that I'm going to toss in there and a little bit of fresh thyme. And we're going to let that steep in here for just a couple of minutes. And as that butter is completely melted, I'm going to add my milk and we've got some heavy cream we're going to add into that. And I'm going to let that just come up to a simmer for a moment. And as that starts to steam a little bit, I'm just going to put a little pinch of salt in there, maybe a little extra pinch of salt. I'm going to turn the heat down to low on that. And I'm just going to put the lid on it and we're going to let that ride till we're ready to put that in the potatoes. And after the potatoes come up to a slow simmer, I'm going to back the heat back down a bit. And it's going to take these guys 15 or 20 minutes to soften up nicely. After those potatoes have cooked and they're nice and soft, I'm going to put them in my colander here. And I'm going to let them sit there for about three or four minutes. And then I'm going to use my potato ricer uh, to rice these guys up. You can use a potato masher or a fork or whatever you like to get this done. Once I have my potatoes riced or mashed, I've got some freshly grated parm that I'm going to put in there. And we're just going to kind of level that out a little bit. And I have strained off the solids from our butter and milk mixture. And then we're going to pour all of that in. And then we're just going to bring this together. And there, you are going to have some of the creamiest and best tasting mashed potatoes you've had in a long time. I'm going to top that with a little bit of freshly cracked black pepper. And guys, that is good to go. You're going to have to give this one a try with your next meal. Let me know what you think. Until next time, this is John Setzler with Atlanta Grill Company. <music>